today I'm going to show you how you can unblur an image. So if you have an image and it's a bit blurry, you might think it's useless. It's actually not because you can unblur it. Maybe you tried Photoshop and you know Photoshop doesn't work on these kind of things. So you need another software. And the good thing is you can try it out yourself for free to see if it works for your photo. And if you like it, you can get the full version. So let's see how it works. So here I'm at the starting screen of ARRT Image Enhancer and I'm going to use this photo. You can see this photo is a bit blurry. You don't see the details pretty good. You can see we can make this sharper to get rid of the blur. So let's do that first. I'm going to drag this image inside ARRT Image Enhancer and now it's gonna generate more image details. Here we have to wait a little bit until this is done with analyzing and then we can do some settings here. Now, here we have the hardware. We can select if we want to use the CPU and GPU for processing. I'm gonna use all units. In the AI model, we can select from different AI models for our image. So for this one, I would go for generate more details and that way I will select the first one, more detail. You can read these, what they are. So maybe you have something that fits this one better. Just make sure to read this and what it means so you can really pick the one that works best for your photo or you can try those different models to see which one works best. Let's use more detail. I'm gonna change it to more detail here and now it's gonna analyze this image again. And here we can see the before and after. Before we had this and now we have this. You can see it got rid of all that blur and look how sharp that looks. Here you can see we have two pass processing enabled. That means it's gonna process it two times, which makes the details even sharper. But sometimes you don't need that. So let's disable this and see what the result will be without the two pass processing. And here is the result without two pass processing. And you can see it also looks great. You can see this is a little bit softer. So this might work better if you wanna keep it like a real photo and not too much sharpness in the photo. Here you can see we can also upscale. So if you have a photo and you also want to upscale it, you can also do this here. So you can upscale up to eight times. That means if you have a 4K photo, you can make it 32K. So that's pretty huge. Let's do eight times and let's look at the details here. Look at that. That looks amazing. Before all that blur and now we de-blur that all. You can also add some text to the image if you want to. I'm going to skip that. I'm going to go to export settings and here we can select the export settings. You can pick from JPEG, PNG and PNG 16 bits and here you can set the quality. So if you want a lower file size, you can drop the quality here. I'm going to go for 100. I want to have the best possible quality and I'm just going to click on run. And it's done within one second. And that's all you actually have to do to get rid of the blur in your photo. You can unblur it with ARRT Image Enhancer. Try it out yourself for free. Check the link in the description and maybe this software will be amazing to get your photos right. If you want to see how to remove background from a photo, make sure to check out this video where I have another amazing tool to get rid of backgrounds from any of your photos and it works better than Photoshop. Thanks for watching this video and catch you in the next one.